like that. Boom, 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 just like that. Eight, 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 productions, just like that. Like, comment, subscribe, just like that. Boom, wait a minute, just like that. Hey, Dub, you ready? Wait a minute. What's up, everybody? It's your boy Alan Wade back again with another video. Guys, if it's your first time here, go ahead, thumbs up, and subscribe to the channel. This close to 50,000 subscribers. Make sure you guys subscribe and contribute so you can be part of the $50,000, well, no, 50,000 subscriber gang, guys. So today we are going to be using our SE600, or you can use your SE625, you can use your PE770, or your PE800 to do this, or your SE1900. Any of those machines, you can stitch along, alanaway.com. Help support the channel, buy yourself some channel merch, and stitch along with this video, guys. So, thank you so much. Without further ado, let's get into this video. A-Dub Productions. All right, guys. You see the SE600 in all of its glory. Very accessible machine. Very low cost. Use my Amazon affiliate link to purchase yours. And this file right here, our Flamingo file, says it's going to take 15 minutes to stitch out. All right, 15 minutes. We are all locked and loaded. We have our cloth material along with our tearaway stabilizer, and these are the colors of choice for today's festivities, guys. So, alanaway.com, pick up your file, visit the site, buy yourself some channel merch, and help support the channel, guys. Let's load up our first color. Best part about it, as usual, is just because it says these colors on the screen, which I showed you how to adjust the colors in yesterday's video. Just because it says those colors on the screen doesn't mean you have to use those colors, which means you can make your flamingo any color you please, guys. Not limited to what it says on the screen. You can make yours any color you want, all right? So keep that in mind when you are embroidering your files. AlanAway.com, hit the button, let it start up. See the SE6 start to do its thing. I have people on Instagram asking me, is this uh, for the SE600? No, I had somebody, I think they asked me, is this, is, did you do this one on the PE800? Guys, um, I don't know whether you realize or not, but a lot of you guys, you should know that these designs you can do on the SE600, PE800, PE770, SE1900, SE625, all of these designs are compatible with all of those different machines, guys. So um, yeah, you're not limited to the machine that I'm using. That's why you see me jump back and forth a lot on the videos with the P800 and the SE600, because those are two that I have at the moment. But, I don't know, combined SE600 plus the P800 equals the SE1900. What do you guys think in the comments below? Should I or should I not grab the SE1900, guys? Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below, and I am going to uh, take into consideration your advice because you guys, without you guys, I couldn't be where I am right now. So if you guys want to see that, if you guys think that's something that I should look into, then I'm going to look into it. And, and maybe we'll bring one to the channel. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. All right, the first part of our flamingo is done. We're gonna change to the second color right now. So we just swipe to release the thread, and then we pull our foot up, take the thread out. All right, this is a follow along video for this file. This file is available. You know exactly where it's available at, guys. Where is it available? AllenAway.com. That's right, you got it, you guessed it allenaway.com hit up the embroidery files and you will see all the many files that you have to choose from not just this one and i added two new files today so check them out check them out matter of fact are they sitting right here let me see if i got them right here i added this one right here that's on the site and i also added this one right here that's on the site so you guys got plenty more designs to choose from so yeah all right, just wanted to throw that out there so you guys can know what to look for. And this flamingo side, this flamingo is going to be awesome, guys. So, uh, yeah, stitching out the second part with SE6. Look at it go. 
Hey guys, if you liked what you saw, make sure you hit that like button and throw that thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Ada Productions, yes. Like I said, to reiterate, this file is good on the SE6, SE625. Actually, it's also good on the, what is it, the SE400 or the P, I, I don't know. I, I, I don't go down that far. I, I've not, never had those smaller ones other than the SE6. Don't feel the need to upgrade from the SE6 to the SE625 because uh, they're the same exact machine, if you ask me. Um, so if you see any of those available in the Amazon store, by the way, use my link down below to purchase your machine. If you see any of those available in the Amazon store and you want to get it, go ahead and grab it and you will be in the money with us, guys. So yeah, look at the SE600. Looking good, right? Stitching this design out. All the intricate little details. Love this bad boy. Somebody asked me in the comments, right? They said, Alan, if you have the Rakoma MT1501, why are you still making, why are you still using your uh, SE600? And I replied that, um, well, I like both machines and not everyone has Rakoma MT1501 money, right? Not everybody has that type of budget, has that type of money to spend on, a, on an embroidery machine, $15,000. Not everyone has that, right? But I'm blessed enough to be able to do so. But just because I'm blessed enough to be able to do so does not mean that I'm gonna stop making content for the people that are not yet granted that opportunity to get one. Because everybody's blessed enough to do it, right? But you just have to get to the position where you can do it. And that's where I come in, right? I'm trying to help you guys elevate, trying to help you guys um, know that you're not left out. Even if you don't have that budget at the moment, emphasis on at the moment, to get this more expensive machine, the commercial machine, it's not over for you. You can work your way up just like I did. And that's why I will continue. I'm continuing and I will continue to keep on making videos for the smaller machines for people that, you know, need a little help or um, need to, you know, see it for themselves that you're capable of doing this stuff on a smaller, less expensive machines, right? Other than that, you would just be like, oh man, I, 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 you know, I can't do it. So uh, yeah, that's the reason why. Not to say I'm not gonna make videos on a Rakoma. Of course I'm gonna do that. You know, you, you gotta use that thing. You gotta show you guys that too, right? By the way, Rakoma link down below in the description below. If you wanna buy a Rakoma commercial embroidery machine, use my affiliate link down in the description below to, to get that. But if not, this is the alternative. You got your brother SE600. You know, you got your P1900 if you wanna ball out on the small machine. Or if you're ready to step it up and go all the way commercial and make an investment in yourself and in your business, you got your Rakoma MT-1501. So yeah, you know, I came from those people that didn't have the budget for the $15,000 machine. I would prefer, and it's my preference, to um, make videos to help uh, the people that are not yet in the position financially to, uh, to, to get those machines because, you know, one day you will be and you can be in that position if that's what you want to do. So I choose to make videos to help those people. There's enough videos, there's enough content creators, you know, making videos on all the ball out stuff. You know, I want to, I'm, you know, just keep it simple for right now, you know? Maybe in a few years, then we'll just, you know, after I feel like I've done my part and I help, I create enough content to help, you know, people, uh, that and I keep on saying it strategically because you know just because you're in a different economic position doesn't mean you're less than at all so yeah the people that aren't able to right now because don't 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 get it twisted guys the tables can turn really really easily so you have to you know humble yourself and understand that just because you're not in that situation doesn't mean you can't be in that situation right let's change threads we swiped already take this thread out and let's put in the other color thread this file, like I said, available at alanaway.com, guys. For the price of $1, most of the files, if not the major majority of the files, maybe a few of them, 
or more expensive, but like the majority of files on my website are one dollar guys and that's exactly the reason why i make it that inexpensive because it coincides with the content and it coincides with the premise that all are included all can do this i don't care what economic um, level you are on everybody can embroider go get four quarters put on a card give it to somebody that has a card buy the file and start embroidering I don't care how much money you have. Everybody can do this, <laughs> right? I don't care, man. This is the way we uh, level the playing field. All inclusive, baby. Let's go 2021. See the SE600 stitching and embroidering away, putting the accent on those feathers, and we'll feel that in just one moment. This flamingo is turning out wonderful. I feel like I'm in a zoo. Sheesh. Look at these feathers, man. Don't pluck those feathers. Looking good. Eight Dub Productions. Yes, yes, yes. Look at these feathers, guys. Now, what you notice is the different pattern of the embroidery for the different things on the flamingo, right? This is not a tatami stitch. This is not a satin stitch. This is a different type of stitch. I can't tell you guys because it's top secret. This is it. We're gonna call this the A-dub stitch. <laughs> Let me stop, I'm bugging right now. Guys, but uh, yeah, this file is looking real good. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. I'm making a little body right there of the flamingo. Let me know what you guys think of this file. Let me know if you wanna see more stuff like this, more birds, and I'll make it happen, guys. But um, um, I have something special that I'm gonna do for everybody that signed up for the mailing list of the website. So uh, those of you guys that signed up for the mailing list already, uh, stay tuned for something in your email coming soon, right? So uh, yeah, let me let a little bit more of the stitch out and I'll be right back on the color change. If you haven't done so already, please hit that like button. I greatly appreciate it, thank you. We have changed colors once again, guys, and we are stitching out some feather detail in this flamingo embroidery designs we're gonna this is looking like small bird as opposed to big bird this is small bird guys all right so when you're stitching this out make sure if you're with your children or something like that make sure you let them know that this is small bird flamingo all right we're making up our own characters right now small blurred bird flamingo coming to a theater near you or maybe not alanaywade.com right now help support the channel buy yourself some channel merch one dollar right so uh, what should we do next? I still got over 50, <laughs> I still got over 50 more designs to uh, put on the website. Um, some of them are gonna get videos, not all of them are. I'm just gonna start rolling stuff out and just putting them on there. So uh, stay tuned for that, keep on checking back. I appreciate it guys. Um, doing the same thing we did last year, but doing it a little bit better hopefully so um let me know what you guys uh plans are let me know what you guys new year's resolutions are in the comments down below all right earlier yesterday some uh commenters tried to snatch my joy but um i had to explain to them that uh sometimes i might be a little um snappy in the comment section because a lot of the times people say stuff without thinking and insinuate things that I didn't say, right? So if you insinuate something that I didn't say that makes me look crazy, don't expect to get a nice response back. I'm gonna give you exactly what you came for, <laughs> for lack of better words, guys. And that's just the way it is. That's just how it is. Um, Online is uh, a very vicious and brutal and sometimes rude place. People who think that they can say whatever they want and you're supposed to just be Mr. Nice Guy just because you're the YouTuber, you know, but no, man, that's not the case. That's not the case. Like, I, I, I am not going to compromise my integrity or compromise my, um, my uh, you're not going to disrespect me in any way and think that you can say anything you want to say to me and expect me to just be Mr. Nice Guy and take it and be nice all the time. Like, you know, I'm still a person too and I feel like 
if you want to be treated with respect, you should treat other people with respect and you should um, not put out rumors and like not uh, insinuate things because this is just not a nice thing to do. And, you know, frankly, uh, if, if people don't like it, then whatever, I don't care. So it is what it is. Okay, so time to switch colors once again. You see the um, flamingo starting to come together, right? Took the thread out already while on my little temper tantrum. Um, this is supposed to be a reddish brown, but I'm just gonna use red. All right, for the front part, for the face, fascia part. It's gonna be a little small part right here. Boom, put that red in. I should use a reddish brown, but whatever. You guys can use whatever color you want, all right? I'm just using whatever is in my reach. And that is what you can do also, guys. But thank you for everybody for all your support. Um, and this should be a lesson to everybody also. Like, it's not just me, man. Like, in any situation in life, like, don't allow people to disrespect you. Don't allow people to bully you just because, you know, you're trying to do something. Sometimes people will try to take advantage of the fact that, hey, I'm a subscriber, I can say whatever I want to you and, and you're just supposed to, you know, take my criticism or, or my comment and be nice. <laughs> yeah, okay, keep on thinking that. I'm gonna give you exactly what you came for. You wanna verbal assault me? You're gonna get a respectful verbal assault, respectful and intelligent verbal assault right back. I am not the one you came to the right place today. <laughs> Sorry. Um, it is what it is, guys. I, I try not to stoop down, but, you know, and I, I'm, I, I really have to just start ignoring the uh, negative or condescending or smart alecky comments. But some people, like, it's, it's hard to interpret text still. I'm, I will, you know, I have a problem with this and I'm, I think I'm going to continue having a problem with this because uh, it's a weird thing. You have some malicious people out here and you have some nice people out here that are just trying to tell a joke. And it's hard to interpret sometimes because you got a whole bunch of, for lack of a better word, jerks out here that are just trying to be mean. And so then when somebody is not trying to be mean, says something like this with, that doesn't have malicious intent, it's kind of hard to decipher the real um the sincere from the fake so like i apologize but um you know it is what it is um you know I, I don't know i can't call it one more color guys that's the black and then we are done with this design and let me know what you guys think in the comments down below let me know what you guys think about what i said if you're especially if you're a content creator like before i didn't all the way get it like when i was a smaller channel and I, I'm, I, I guess I'm a medium-sized channel now. I don't know. What do you guys consider this channel? For, over 45,000 subscribers. What are you? Are you? You're like a medium YouTuber, right? I'm not a big YouTuber. I'm a medium YouTuber, correct? I, that's what I think. I don't know. I don't have 100,000 subscribers, so I can't be considered a big YouTuber. I, don't, I think 100,000 subscribers after that. Anything after 100,000 and above, you're a big YouTuber, right? Um, let me know what you guys think. Um, you know, back when I had 5,000, I'd say... Or, or 1,000, I'd say, I'd say 50,000 was a lot. But we're gonna have 50,000 this month, guys, I'm pretty sure. So um, make sure you guys stay tuned for that. And this design is almost done. And it's done. All right, so here we go. Swipe once, release, and cut this little stupid stitch right here. All right. And let's see what we got, guys. We got another stitch to cut in the beak area. Let's see what we got. What do you guys think, man? Mr. Flamingo, alanyweed.com, $1. Just one little stitch right here to uh, trim. Boom. Boom. I think there's, is there, no, is there, is there, yeah, is, no, I can't, I can't quite, yes, there is. Couldn't quite see it, it was hiding. But there it is right there. Perfect. What do you guys think? Comments below. Let me know. I'm starting to think I shouldn't have said this was one dollar. This is a pretty nice file here. Now nah, it's gonna be one dollar guys. One dollar alanyway.com. Help support the channel. Everything accessible to you guys. Um, easy stitch out. 
short amount of time to embroider. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Don't forget to visit the merch store, share it with your friends, tell all your all your embroidery pals to check it out. All right. And look, design all done. Mm-hmm. I bet you thought my flamingo wasn't going to look good, didn't you? Give me a thumbs up if this flamingo looks good. Let me know in the comments section what you think about my flamingo. And you can get it for $1. $1. All inclusive all year long, baby. Subscribe, like, comment. Let me know what you think. Follow me on Instagram, Instagram.com backslash A-Dub Productions. Let me know what other designs you guys are interested in seeing. I have a whole slew of them to roll out. Gonna implement some more videos in between here. This year, we're gonna do something special with the channel, guys. So stay tuned for the announcements, and I'll talk to you guys on the next video. It's your boy, Alan Wade. See you guys tomorrow. Peace. Turn up that. Crank it up. Why listen to the rest when you're rockin' with the best, baby?